My name is Dr. Beatrice Mudoni Mainge. I am a counseling psychologist by profession, uh, specifically uh, specialized in addiction counseling. I am the director of Nobility House, a place where we work with people who are struggling with uh, uh, substance use disorders. Our vision in Nobility House is the restoration of human dignity. And the reason why I came up with this vision is because I believe that if you are able to restore people's dignity, then it is possible for them to become self-regulating. Because dignity will direct you as to the places that you can go, the places that you cannot go, the people that you can associate with and those that you cannot associate with. So when we admit people to Nobility House, the first thing that we want to communicate to them is that they are human beings and that they are dignified. And that is why when you look at our facility, we have tried as much as possible to communicate this to our residents. From the environment, the, 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 the bedrooms where they sleep, the food that we give them, everything that we do is meant to communicate human dignity. We are located in Kikuyu, specifically in Gesha, along the Nakuru Nairobi Highway. And the place is very serene. We have a 20 bed capacity. And maybe someone may be asking, where did the vision and the story of Nobility House start? I would like to mention that I have worked with the government for the last 24 years, specifically in the area of management of alcohol and drug abuse among the employees of the organization that I was working for. I was in charge of the alcohol and drug abuse desk and I was charged with the responsibility of preparing the <coughs> policies for the management of uh, substance use disorders among the employees and also uh, sensitization, counseling, one-on-one, -on -one, and group counseling. But my passion has always been to work with the people who are struggling with substance use disorders. And I had always wanted to begin a private facility when I leave the government employment. And last year, in 2018, that is when I resigned from government in 2018 in the month of September and that is when I established this place Nobility House because of the passion of the restoration of human dignity and I would say that the day we bought the furniture for this place is the day when we admitted our first client and to date we are almost one and a half years old. We have handled close to 45 clients so far. And our success uh, story is rising by the day. We have many clients who have been coming back to encourage those who are still admitted to just tell them that it is possible uh, to live in sobriety. Hi, my name is Kennedy Baraza. Alcohol is not only a problem in Africa, but the entire world. I realized that I had a problem in alcohol, with alcohol and drug abuse, and I was referred to nobility because it is the best place in the country. Therefore, I know my being here will not be in vain. I know I'll come out as a better person and as a better man to help the society to be a better place. My names are Raymond Waweru. I am a counselor, uh, addiction counselor and a counseling uh, psychologist. Uh, here at Nobility, uh, Nobility House, I am a program uh, director or program coordinator. And uh, part of my duties here in um, uh, nobility house 
is to ensure that uh, the program uh, runs uh, smoothly, to ensure that uh, residents are given uh, proper care, to ensure that uh, clients get uh, assessments and they are accorded uh, treatment according to the treatment uh, plan. I also uh, assist my uh, director in ensuring that the mission and objectives of Nobility House uh, are running and continue to serve uh, the group of uh, people that we have established, established this facility to assist. And this group of people we assist here are adults uh, who have uh, or persons with alcohol and drugs uh, problems. These adults are from the age of uh, 18 years and above to the age of 75 years, both uh, men and women. Hi, I am Bill Dad Ngumbi from Makweni County. I am 87 days in this uh, facility of Nobility House. I came here uh, for alcohol treatment. I was in full of denial, but on reporting to this place, so many things have taken place in positivity to change my life for good. I can say that uh, I can testify that this place has qualified uh, counselors who have given me proper education that is able to cope with the situations of uh, uh, sobriety out there. I've also liked the interaction with uh, the facilities around, the recreational facilities around, the nature of uh, welfare activities that are handled in this place, meals and provisions have all been good. I can also say that my life was actually, uh, I was in denial and out of coming to this place, I've got so many things that have changed my life positively. I've also been able to appreciate the importance of uh, uh, sobriety. Honestly, I can say this is a place somebody should embrace and try his life for recovery. Thank you. We have had, uh, like I've said, many uh, success stories. We have had people coming back. We have had people even discovering their purpose while they are here. Because one of the things also that disturb people and push them into alcoholism is when people are placed wrongly, even in their professions, or when someone is struggling to do something that they are not gifted uh, in doing. And so we, ha we have also been trying to help people uh, connect with their purpose. Because it is said that the day you discover your purpose is the day that you start living. When you discover your purpose, then life becomes easier. Because when people are, are placed wrongly in their professions, it is like pushing rocks uphill. But once you discover your purpose, then things start uh, flowing easily. So we have also been uh, doing that, helping people uh, to connect with their purpose and also helping people to reconnect with their families because, like I have said, issues of uh, social support are very uh, protective in the area of, of addiction. Nobility House, I, I keep uh, communicating to our residents that this is their second home. I see a heaven for those who feel uh, that their lives are compromised by substance use disorders. I see a place where people uh, come back to reconnect with their purpose, where people come back to uh, regain themselves, where people come back when they have forgotten who they are. Because like I said, that our vision is the restoration of human dignity. I believe that the work that we are doing at Nobility House, we are actually partnering with God to help people connect with their purpose. Helping uh, sons and daughters, you know, regain their place in the society. When we see one parent coming back to say that you gave me back the son that I always loved, that gives us joy and we want to be there even for the next hundred years doing the same thing. When we see a wife coming back here 
to tell us that yes you saved my husband you saved my my the father of my children it gives us the strength to keep going on and on and on so i'd say that i see the the the, the facility expanding i see more people coming to sample uh, the, the services that that we are offering uh, so that we can also contribute to the, the the big four agenda because i believe that when there is no health without mental health so what we are doing is uh, contributing in the area of mental health when we restore the dignity of that father then he's able to take his rightful place uh, in the family when we restore the dignity of that son that daughter they are able to take up their 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 place in the family when we restore the the dignity of the society then this translates to dignity for the country and then we can have a healthy workforce to contribute to the the, the big four agenda, the vision 2030, and to see the transformation of this country. There is one slogan that we keep uh, saying in this place. We keep saying that if it has to be, then it is up to me. Meaning that if there is any change that is going to take place, it has to come from within me. So we help them to take personal responsibility so that even when they leave Nobility House, then they'll be self-driven, they'll be self-directing, and they take the responsibility for their own own recovery. If I may also add that as a director of this place, I am also an addiction counselor. I am certi certified by NACADA. I am also certified by an international body, Colombo. So I'm, a, I'm an internationally accredited addiction counselor. Besides having a PhD in counseling psychology, and specifically in the area of addiction studies. So, and our counselors are also uh, accredited, they are addiction counselors, and like I said, that we also work with psychiatrists to ensure that our services are all round and that they are professional. Thank you.